What up, NFT fam? I'm just uh, hanging out drawing some pieces of art. This is female. <laughs> and some. I'm drinking some beer. <laughs> um, she's a female because she shows her boobs for money. <laughs> um, be mine. Love me. Alone. We got a theme, people. Rainbow. Marriage sucks. <laughs> Shake your body. <laughs> a person's head. Anticipation, participation, I don't fucking know. A dude with flower eyes, spider webs, and a swan. That's what came out of my brain today. Uh, moving straight along, this was great. For the second time this year, over eight weeks, rarity farming season, I'm getting about 1K a week for my NFTs. That's over 16,000 a year. So Avagachi is still the number one leader in my mind in terms of uh, passive income. Adidas dropped an NFT, but I honestly did not understand like where it was or what it was. Like, why can't you just drop it on OpenSea so I can buy one? I don't get it. This Gary V interview from V Friends back in May, wonderful. Take a look at it. Um, I was in this space, um, and this guy he launched his own product project, and he was saying how like he's giving feedback, which was really cool. Because there's a lot of uh, spaces that don't like shilling, but I like it that he was giving feedback, you know. He was saying, like, tell more about your story. So my story is uh, my flowers were kind of created as a way. I think they spawn just out of straight up depression and heartbreak. So <laughs> maybe that's what the evolution part of it is. I don't know. But I just started doodling. <laughs> like, that was just a thing. Cool dogs. Um, is kind of like the dog version of cool cats and it was kind of getting popular recently. Um, I was trying to figure out if the NFT is still launching for Gary V's book, but it's not. It was only back in August. So in case you're wondering about that, there's another Avagachi bid to earn land auction coming up. Um, this was another listen, another fun listen. My mom said another Gary V like audio, you know, interview or whatever it was. Bo uh, Board Ape Yacht Club and... Mutant Ape Yacht Club, they're having a mobile game competition, a 10-day event for only members, so it's interesting. I don't know what the prizes are or anything like that. The The floor for Mutant Ape Yacht Club has definitely jumped. It was like four ETH the other day, and then now it's like, I don't know, eight or something or seven. Um, he had a space the other day that I missed because I was sleeping. Um, Crypto Pussies is a nice like another like female artist who is sharing her work and has retweeted my work. So if you're interested, take a look. Um, what else? This was really funny. My, I told my mom that I sold two NFTs and she was like, can you make my stuff digital? <laughs> she doesn't understand what's going on. So I was like, okay, they're not NFTs. I just was like, well, maybe somebody would be interested in petite needle points. Like back in her day, she did this to overcome her sadness and depression when my dad left or maybe even before when her husband, her first husband left her. Like, it's it's rough out here for some people. So this is small little needlepoint with thread. And she always wanted to sell it. And I think it's beautiful. But nobody was ever interested. Like, she could never figure out a market for it. So if you're interested in this, let me know. She would love to sell it to you. Um, I saw that Adam Bomb Squad has now 8,000 members, which is cool. This was really cute. It's Fly Frog. I still think the Fly Frogs is so cute. And as a little like desktop thing, it's just adorable. Um, and that's it for now. So a lot of little things today. I hope you have a good night. And if you're interested in my project, it's posted up here. It's called The Evolution of Flowers. And this somebody told me that I shouldn't just post the, um, hold on, I'm going to show you. I shouldn't just post it like this. I had it pinned like this. They were like, you should just pin pieces of your artwork and the open sea collection. So there it is. If you're interested, thank you so much. Also today I was in a space, a Twitter space. If you go into Twitter spaces and you talk, you definitely get more followers that way. And then, um, the second thing that I wanted to say was that, um, oh yeah, this one person, I, did I forget it again? No, this one person, what the fuck is the story that I want to tell? It literally flew out of my head. Um, the other one was like, tell your story. 
I, I don't, I honestly don't even know. It totally flew out of my head. I'll probably remember tomorrow. Anyway, have a good night. Remember to like and comment and subscribe and I'll see you guys later. Bye.